is we simply take this cost of 2016 of what we think Georgia Power is planning on billing you for electricity, the average retail rate, and we ask to compete. Now, to compete with it doesn't mean that we sell Georgia Power the power so they can mark it up and sell it to the retail people. We're saying, no, you said before we're not competitive. Now let's compete eyeball to eyeball the same grid. Okay? That's what this does. And so, um, <coughs> what you do is, is, is I run through the numbers, I calculate the bond payments, operations, and maintenance. And I pay a grid access fee. If you look at the amount of money George Power loses in profits by us taking the uh, revenues away from them to get watch, we're able to compensate them the profits back, the shareholders' the profits back. Because if we were back, we don't want to hurt the utility company. As much as people might get angry at George Power, we still depend upon them. It's not in our best interest to break these guys or hurt them like they've been hurt in the country, like the utility company's been hurt in the country. It's not. So what we're compensating them back for is we call it grid access fee. Um, in exchange for putting us up there and let us sell retail, we pay a two cents a kilowatt hour. Now there'll be a lot of conversation about this. You know, they're gonna say it's not enough. That, that's fine. It just so happens I have a lot of power to throw in this analysis. A lot of room to absorb a lot. 